The Duchess of York has spoken out about her reaction when she found out the Duchess of Cornwall had decided not to attend Princess Eugenie and Jack Brooks Banks' royal wedding. Speaking to the Daily Mail, she said, I think it's wonderful she kept to her engagement, especially as it was with children. She's a wonderful lady and was a great friend of my mom. All's well there, then. Camilla honored a long-held engagement to visit the Duke of Rothsay Highland Games Pavilion in Braemar, Aberdeenshire, instead of the big day in Windsor. She had morning tea with members of the local community, before meeting pupils at nearby Crathy Primary School. At the time, a royal source confirmed, the Duchess has a long-standing engagement and didn't want to let anyone down. Although Camilla will have been missed at the celebration, some 30 members of the royal family gathered to watch Prince Andrew and Sarah's youngest daughter marry her long-term partner Jack Brooks Bank. Among them were the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, who married at the same chapel less than five months before. Sarah added of the royal nuptials, My proudest moment was watching Eugenie standing tall, very proud to show her scoliosis scar in her low-back dress. I'd gone to all the fittings and sat there beaming with delight, and because there was no avail it was a very strong statement. The bride looked stunning in a bespoke gown designed by Peter Pilato and Christopher Devos. It was complemented by the gravel emerald Kakoshnik tiara, lent to her by the Queen, and a pair of diamond and emerald drop earrings that were a wedding gift from her new husband. The tiara danced to her, Sarah said. She was just so radiant. She said, Mom, I thought I was going to get nerves, but she didn't.